What's up YouTube? Today we're not in the still standing garage. Today we're on the road. I'm gonna go see a man about a G-Body. But first I'm gonna go meet up with my buddy Mark. He's gonna help me try to go get this. I'm gonna go hit up the U-Haul, grab a trailer, go check it out. From what I was looking at on the pictures and talking to this person, it looked like it was a really good uh, G-Body. So we're gonna go check it out. We'll see how this turns out. And it's gonna be a long day for me. It's very early in the morning. I'm a night shift person. It's about 7.47 right now. It's super early for me. Uh, so yeah, so we're gonna go do that today and see how this uh, turns out. Don't forget to hit up the Still Standing store. If you wanna support the channel, go and grab yourself some merch, some apparel, hoodie, shirt. Uh, check that out. And uh, the link's always in the description. All right, let's go. I did bring some starter fluid and a battery. So we're gonna see how this goes. I'm right here at Mark's house. So we're gonna take off in a little bit. All right, so we're on our way to U-Haul now with the homie Mark over here. Hell yeah. So my car's good where it's at, right? Yeah, nobody should probably jack it. All right, so we're gonna show up at U-Haul real quick and then uh, pick that trailer up and then we'll be on our way. Let's go. YouTube so we just picked up the trailer we're gonna jump on the freeway real quick we're gonna head that way uh, it's about 80 miles away from here so we're gonna see how this shit goes you ready let's do it let's run it let's go not coming out or what <laughs> so it happened it actually went through got the car as you can see it's back there i'll show you what kind of car it is right now what kind of g body we got thank you mark for the help over here straight handling so we're gonna get it home it's a long trip home so we'll check it out in a bit show you guys the interior the engine all that stuff and uh we'll get it going from there want to get lit mark and get a monster Red Bull? Red Bull, sugar free. Nice. All that uh, loading got us tired. <laughs> Hell yeah. Well, we're gonna go ahead and get it home, so let's go. So we pulled over real quick, go use the restroom, go hit up Carl's Jr. real quick. But it's looking good. Obviously, I'm gonna do a couple more videos before this video ends, show you guys the whole thing. 79 Monte Carlo right here. I'll show you guys when we get home. But that's what it looks like so far, let's go. All right, you two, so we made it back safely. Everything went well. Forgot to mention that it was down there in San Diego pretty far from here i live in fontana so it was it was a it was a long drive but we ended up making it back so everything's good the car's here so it's a 1979 monte carlo let's check it out let's go so there it is bumper needs some work needs some work but well, the whole car needs some work looking pretty good right here has that damage right there all that rust looking pretty good the doors do need some pin and pushing replacement that's what it looks like in the front it's a 79 but it has the 78 Monte Carlo um, lenses right here so that's from a 78 but this is a 79 we'll go around all the way the other way We'll look at that interior right now in a little bit. Let's 
paint's flaking off in the back over here. Came with some six by nines. Same thing over here, but not as bad. The other side does look like it's more busted. Chrome trim's a little banged up right here, but it uh, looks like the body's good. Came with the OG hubcaps, but I took them off already. So it looks like this side it has, it has a dent right here. There's a dent right there. You can fix that. The hood. Has that needs to be replaced, cut out and replaced. Header panel here is cracked. Let's see if I could fix that or I could probably buy another one. Same thing right here. Other than that, everything else is surface rust. Be fixed. So let's look at that interior right now. Take a nice wide shot or from a distance. does come with the, the vinyl top 75% on I'm thinking of putting this back on it came with the, the strip here but I took it off because it was coming off when we were towing it there it is Let's look at that interior right now so that's the interior right there it's power windows not not a power lock I was looking at this too, but there's it's a little bit of rush right here, but I think that could be fixed too. It's not a problem. So look at that interior. It looks faded. Dashboard only has a few cracks. It's better than my 78. You see, look at that bench. is all faded. Sitting out pretty much in the sun for a while, I guess. But yeah, it's not that bad in here. Obviously, it still needs to be restored. Look at that back seat. Back seat looks pretty good, but it is faded from the back. The back hole, if you look at it from the outside, it is faded. The, the hard top, the what is it called? The headliner. Obviously, this car needs does need a lot of work. We'll look at the engine right now in a little bit. Yeah, what it looks like dashboard looks pretty good. Like I said, I do have the piece right here. It's right here on the floor right there all this needs to be cleaned up it was all greasy and everything when I, when I was trying to move it around so we'll look at it right now yeah. so it is a v8 305 all original so it has all the AC components and the the emissions system we did try to crank it when we were over there but it cranked over and it sounded like it wanted to turn on, but we kind of gave up because we needed to go already. But it was looking pretty good. It's obviously, it needs attention. The car needs a lot of work. So that's what this looks like. See all that, that surface rust all right there all on top right here. Also needs the, the fan shroud replaced. Not sure if that radiator is the, the OG one because it is sticking up a little bit. So I'm have to figure that out later. That's what it looks like. Little four barrel original. All these areas here. Look at all that. Needs work. All this right here. Needs work. All of it needs work. Pop open the trunk. It's pretty clean in here. Obviously when I get to it, I'm gonna remove all this carpet and see what it looks like underneath. Looks pretty good. There's that aluminum trunk lid for the V8. It looks like it was sitting under a tree. But yeah, look at all that. Needs a lot of TLC.
here's the thing i wanted to tell you guys about what my plans are with this car for now for now i'm not touching it i'm gonna leave it alone i'm gonna try to see if i can get it started get that going but what i am gonna end up doing is i need to focus on the monte over here my 78 i have three projects going on so it's the 78 the 83 regal and the 79 monte carlo that i just uh, acquired the one that i just purchased um so what i'm gonna end up doing is I am recording for this one as you guys can tell in this video that the hood's already on but i am working on getting that video out possibly next week by the time this one uh, uh, uploads so i am going to focus on this one because this one's a lot closer to being done being out on the street so i'm not going to be jumping back and forth from one car to the other like i said i probably just end up uh, trying to get the 79 going and uh, just to get it started right and then seeing kind of what it needs and making a list probably but that's about it. If anything, I'm going to make a playlist. Uh, just like how I have the 78, I have a playlist for the 78 on my channel. Same thing with the 83, I have a playlist for that one. As I work on them, I do try to upload it to those playlists so you guys can check those out all in one shot. But like I said, priority, 78 Monte. That one needs to be done, needs to be get, uh, be out there in the street. So we got to get that one going. So um, I just wanted to introduce the 79 to the um, channel and let you guys check that out. Uh, like I, like you guys saw, it is it's, it needs work, but the work's not going to be done right now. I'm working on this one right now. So, all right, guys, so that's going to be it for this channel. Stay tuned for these updates on this Monte. We're going to keep it going on this one. Check out the playlist. I have the playlist of the whole build of this one, the build of the, the 83 Regal, and then we're going to start a playlist for the 79, which is where this uh, video is going. So stay tuned for those videos when I get this moving. Um, shout out to Mark out there that helped me out to go get this car. It was a long trip. We got it done. Appreciate your help. Uh, thank you all that are supporting the channel, supporting the Still Standing brand. Check out the link in the description. Check out the store. Get you some merch. And shout out to, special shout out to um, Fernando and Nando Maciel. His son Nando Maciel out there in Phoenix. They're building a, or working on a Monte as well. Shout out to you guys. Thank you for watching. Appreciate the support. Let's go.